All right, so Michel, uh, okay, we're gonna do learn how to swim today. It's the first time you scared a bit, you never did swim before. So the first thing is to learn how to be relaxed and comfortable looking into the water. You don't have to practice where it's deep, just stay where it's shallow, okay? So you can practice on the stairs here, you can practice in the pool where you touch the bottom. The more important thing is to learn how to exhale and relax your breathing. So you can play music with your mouth. You can look in the water, blow bubbles and exhale for five seconds. Then when you are out of air, you go up. You breathe in, one big breathe in, not two, not <laughs> only one big, and again, five second bubbles, okay? So I'm gonna hold the camera up, and you're gonna show me here. It's very easy. So just five second, take a big breathe, and bubbles. One, two, three, four, a breathe and down. Stay on your legs if you want, you don't have to fly first. Relax as much as possible. How relaxed are you? One, two, three, four, breathe. One, two, three, four, up. One, two, three, four, up, top, top. All right, that's very good. That's the first step, okay? The second step will be to be able to do the same, but don't touch the ground. Because if you know, notice there, in the shallow pool where you can touch the bottom anytime, your body floats, your body fly on the water. So you can, you can feel then you can fly like Superman on the top of the water. You don't have to touch the ground with your legs and you don't have to scare because all your body gonna just naturally float. That's the natural buoyancy, okay? More you relax, more you float. And you have to accept to look down. So you have to do your five second bubbles. Looking into the water, looking at the bottom of the pool and let your body just be horizontal. Your legs gonna fly, your arms gonna fly, you will feel like you are in the skydiving, okay? So I'm gonna help you first, and I'm right here to help you if you need. Take my hand, and we do together. Bubbles, accept to fly. Very good, don't panic. And down. If you need to touch the ground anytime, touch the ground. Can you feel your body is floating here? I help you with my hand, but you can fly, see? Relax. Your legs are here. All right. Go ahead. Anytime you want, you can touch the ground. That's the thing. Anytime you want, you can touch the ground. So show me how you can. From here, where you are, blow your bubbles, relax, and fly to me. Like, just come and fly. Yeah? One, two, three, four, and go ahead. Relax when you go up. Always move slowly. Easy. Good. All right. I still help you. All right. Let's go to the wall. And there is the wall. All right, look. Now you can do the same. You can fly pushing with your feet on the wall to have a bit more speed. Remember? Relax. Blow your bubble. Five seconds. <laughs> Then you can go up and breathe, but always blow your bubbles five seconds. Let's go. Take a big breath, push on the wall, look at the ground, relax, 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 and breathe. Relax, cool, very good. All right? We can go back together, all right? I push you slightly, two, one, and go. Just fly. Your body is relaxed, you can fly. So, never fight, never panic, never scare. That's the thing. Always control your breathing, okay? Last one. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Go up, slowly up. And down. Very good. You can touch the ground. How do you feel now? You okay? Good. Okay, look. Now we are eating the last portion of the training to learn how to swim safe and independent. You just need to learn the last thing. The last thing, once you are able to relax, once you know how to blow your bubbles, once you can feel your body can fly on the surface, horizontal, looking at the bottom, okay, your legs up, your arms up, then you can start to, after the bubbles, push with your hand into the water to go up with your head. Remember, the water is resistance. So if you pull this way, your body moves this way. If you push your hand down, your body goes up. If you push your hand like this, you will go down. It's all about reaction, okay? Because it's a resistance. 
So you are flying like a bird, like Superman in the water, and now you want to breathe. To breathe, you want your hands to go up, right? Then push your hands up, and in the same time, push your hand down. Because you push your hands up and your hand push down, your body will go up. Very easy, okay? So I want to breathe, I blow my bubbles. It's time for me to breathe. I relax, I push my hand down, and I go up with my hand. And then naturally after I go down, but it's fine. I have breathe, so I go down and I blow again my bubbles. So you repeat that momentum. Five second bubbles, push your hand down, breathe. And again, five second bubbles. And again. And again. And you need to feel relaxed. After, you can start to kick with your legs on the surface to move faster. You can start to swim with moving your hand and go faster on the speed, but the more important is not to go fast. The more important is to feel comfortable, relax, control your breathing. And every time you want to go up, push down your hand, breathe one time, feel relaxed, look down again, and enjoy the bubbles. Okay? So now it's your turn. I'm going to carry the camera on my head to help you more. There. Let's do it. All right, so we are together here, like a team. You can come to me, five second bubbles. When you need to breathe, remember, just push your hand in the water and go help with your head. I'm gonna help you with my hand at the time you need to breathe. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Push down, breathe and relax. Good. One, two, three, four. Relax. One, two, three, four. Good, relax. All right, that's very good. How do you feel? Okay, you don't have to go so high to breathe with your mouth. Just above the surface is enough. More you go high, more after you will go down. So just stabilize, okay? Just breathe close to the water is enough. Let's go again. One, two, three, four. Pull and breathe and down. One, two, three. One big breathing. That's amazing. All right. Slow down. Very good. Okay, look. Are you relaxed? Do you scared? No? You feel you can float? You feel you control, okay? You go down with your hand, you go up with your mouth, you breathe, and after you relax. You are safe when you are looking in the water because your body floats. It's very hard to stay up and, and to fight to stay above the surface. That's how you learn how to swim not really correctly. So learn how to just relax and dive. So we're going to be this way and I'm helping you from the back now, okay? Now just go, accept, I'm just on the side, it's fine. You can touch the ground anytime you need. And go. One, two, three, four. Breathe and down. Very good, relax. Two, three, four. Breathe and down. You're great. Two, three. Push down when you want to go ahead. A bigger pulling. Bigger pulling. Bigger pulling. Do you want me to give you the paddle now to have more power? Okay, the paddle will help you for the sensation, okay? Which is great. So I have the paddle here. Whoopla. Okay. These two paddles will give you more resistance in the water. So it's the same. You're gonna push the paddle down, you're gonna go up. If you push this way, you're gonna move this way. If you go down, you go up. If you push down, you go down. Okay. So here. Put your hand inside, okay, and here, that's very good. Since you can relax, since you feel the breathing is correct, you control your hair, you control your lungs, you exhale slowly and you swim slowly, everything is in slow motion, everything is fine, okay? Let's do the same exercise. One, two, three, four, pull down and breathe, you need to pull down. Two, three, four, pull down. Okay, Remy, listen. When you want to breathe, you need to pull down because it will give you some resistance to push your body up. Yes, down in the water. If you go down, your body is going up. Don't hesitate to move your hand, okay? All right? You float perfectly though. Now just learn how to pull down more. One, two, three, four, pull down, breathe and down. Relax when you pull down. Breathe. Relax. You need to relax. That's perfect. Just need to. When you pull down, you go up with your mouth and then you breathe in. 
and then after you go down and you relax it's all good just okay just relax one two three pull it down and down pull it down and down one two three pull it down one two three pull it down all right so you know to help you for the bubbles I used to say then you can play sort of music like a child you know so you blow your bubbles like then you pull down then you breathe in one second only so five seconds to blow bubbles one second to breathe in I pull down I relax I breathe in in one big second I put all the hair in my legs and then I go down and I play the music again all right you're doing great. Go slowly. One, two, three, four. Breathe. It was good. It was good. You did all good. The only thing is in your head you panic a bit when I'm not touching you. It's the same. You just pull down and breathe in. Your mouth was out. Open your mouth and let the hair go in. Okay? I help you first. One, two, three. Pull down. Relax, my friend. You start to again. Pull down with your hand. Yes. Two, three. Pull down. Move your hand when you want to breathe. Three. Pull down. Move your hand. One, two, three. Pull down. You need to feel. When you want to breathe, move your hand to breathe. You need to match your hand with your intention to breathe. If you want to breathe, move your hand. In the same time. You pull down, you go up with your head, and then you breathe, okay? You match the, the motion. Go. One, two, three, pull down, and breathe, and relax, relax, it's okay, it's fine, it's all easy. You can feel it yourself already, okay? I'm on the side here, I will let you use your both hands, okay? Let's go together, right? One, two, three, pull down, and down. One, two, three, pull down, relax, that's the way. I'm helping you from the side. Pull down, relax, it's good. Look, I help your body, your horizontal, you're good. One, two, three, pull down, relax. One, two, three, pull down. One, two, three, pull down, relax, we are good. We are good, we are good. It's all in your mind. I'm very serious. You have the skill. You just need to let go the fear in your stomach and accept that here everything is safe. You touch the ground, you are with a, with a coach. It's, the environment is super safe. You will never drink water, you know how to blow bubbles, you know how to breathe, you know, everything is fine. Okay? If I don't touch you sometimes, you keep going on the same, on the same intensity. You can do it, okay? Okay. One, two, three, pull down. Good. One, two, three. I hold from the hips now. Pull down. Very good. One, two, three. Pull down. That's very good, you see? I right, start for a while. Can you feel it? I, at the beginning, you need me to hold your legs, to hold your hands. Now I can hold your shoulders. And at the end, I was holding a bit of your hips. But the rest of the time, you do alone. It was because you relax and go slowly. When you want to learn how to swim, if you go fast, you fight. The, the speed is usually a factor of fear. And we don't want the fear. We want you to be super easy in the water. Comfortable, confident, enjoying the sensation of floating, okay? So we're going to move this way. And the same. Sometimes I help, sometimes I help less. Just keep the same thing. And you will realize that without my help, you can swim alone. Okay? One, two, three, pull down and go. Keep relaxing. Relax. One, two, three, pull down. One, two, three, pull down. Relax. Keep the body horizontal. Keep floating. Go down. Remy, Remy, Remy. Every time you start to panic, every time you do mistake. It's all about this. Just, I'm there. One moment you look for me, I don't know why. Don't look for me, just keep going. It's super fine. You're doing great, actually. I don't help much. I just touch, you know, because the block is there in your head. 
there's nothing to block with okay just relax remember relax enjoy the sensation go one two three pull down breathe and down one two three pull down breathe and down try to relax feel you can float anytime you want to breathe you can just match your pushing all right, you start to breathe too fast. You, you start to breathe, breathe. That's too fast. Remember, take your time. The thing is to go slowly. Really, go super slow. You can do more than five seconds if you want. Breathe slowly. Keep that slow motion. More you're slow, more you relax. Trust me. Here, it's all about being relaxed. Okay. One, two, three, four. Go ahead, breathe and down. You are fine, your body float. The water is easy to control. When you want to breathe up, just pull down and breathe. Excellent. Don't fight, don't panic, go slowly. It's all about being, enjoying the moment. The timing when you want to go up, move your hand, go up with your head and breathe in and go down and float again see you can float alone you still can do it look i'm here i'm just on the side do it calm down just do it i don't touch you it's okay it's the same you you see you look at me you did it and then you're like hey don't touch me something happens it's the same you have the time to breathe you have the windows to breathe when you pull down you go up with your head breathe and then after you go down it's normal to go down after don't scare to go down after that's what you want. You want to go back down in the water because you did breathing, okay? We do a little bit and I'll let you to finish alone just when we are close there. It's very, it's very simple, go. You are doing great. One, two, three, pull down, relax, man, relax. Two, three, pull down, relax. It's fine. Your body floats through. This one, calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down. The breath. You're gonna relax when you start to release the fear in your stomach. When your breathing is slow, remember the music. Breathe and relax. All right? Okay. Let's go slow this way. One, two, three, four. Breathe and relax. Yes. Take your time, man. Breathe and relax. Take your time. Yes, you did one alone. That's wonderful, man. So, you did one alone, right? You did it alone? Did you panic? You see, when you go slow, it's easy, right? I find. That's brilliant. You come back from here to me. You do the same, look. I'm just right here. You go super slow. You breathe in one time and you finish super slow. That's it. That's it. Now you can do it alone, relax, I saw it. You can do it once, you can do it twice, you can do it all the time. Then you know how to swim. Let's go. Blow your bubbles, five seconds, fly and relax. Pull down, breathe and down. One, two, three, four, five, finish. One. I know you feel a bit like the skill is not that simple. It is super easy, right? You blow bubbles, five seconds, you need to breathe, pull down with your hand, match the breathing of your head, and then go down again and blow bubbles. We do again, blow bubbles, go up, blow bubbles again. Let's go. Bubbles and relax, and then go up, breathe. Uh oh. Look, this one you forgot to breathe in. You go up, but because you scared a little bit, you keep your mouth closed. Just breathe in. Look. <gasps> breathe in then go down try again if you're scared again we go back to the normal one one two three four and breathe in one two three okay that's good you did it you did it not 100 percent relaxed but you did it do it again and try to relax okay one, two, three, four. Pull down, breathe. Yes, that is good. 